Hi, uh, welcome to this short little video on how to make cos a the subject of a squared equals b squared plus c squared minus 2bc cos a. So this is your formula for the cosine rule here. Uh, the reason why this is important is because if you're working at the angle then it's easier to use the formula when cos a is the subject. So let me show you how to do this. So the first thing you need to do then is move this term here to the right hand side to the left hand side of the formula. So the opposite to minus 2bc cos a is to add 2bc cos a to both sides. So our next line will be a squared plus 2bc cos a equals b squared plus c squared. So the next thing we want to do then is move the a squared to the right hand side so we can do this by minusing a squared from both sides. So this will give us 2bc cos a equals b squared plus c squared minus a squared. So I've just got one more thing to do now. Cos a has now been multiplied by 2bc so we just need to divide both sides by 2bc. So this will give us a formula of cos capital A equals b squared plus c squared minus a squared all over 2bc. And this is the formula which you use for working out the angle in a non right angled triangle if you're given three of the side lengths. Thanks for watching.